In this question, packages are coming off a conveyor belt and we are asked to determine how close and how far we can place the catching cart so that each package falls into it. Let's write down what we know. In the horizontal direction, the starting location is 0 meters. Location A is a distance of R away from the starting location, and location B is R plus 1 meters. The horizontal component of velocity is 2 cos 30 degrees, which is 1.732 meters per second. For the vertical direction, we have the starting location at 0 meters. The final location, or in other words, the distance the package falls, is negative 3 meters. The vertical component of velocity is negative 2 sine 30 degrees, or negative 1 meters per second. Remember that our coordinate system is placed so that up is positive and to the right is positive. Gravity also affects the package, so we have negative 9.81 meters per second squared. Let's first figure out how long it takes for the package to drop into the cart. To do that, we can use this equation, which is for vertical motion. Let's substitute what we know. We can solve for t, and we are only interested in the positive value. So in other words, it takes the package 0.68 seconds for it to fall and come to a stop. Now we can write an equation for horizontal motion. For that, we will use this equation. Let's substitute what we know, including the time value we just found. For this part, we are only trying to find the distance r. In other words, our final location in the x direction is r. We can use the same equation to find the maximum distance by using r plus 1. So let's substitute those values in. So our maximum value is 1.189 meters, and the minimum value is 0.189 meters. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please comment below.